Uh, cheer they are. Handsome. <laughs> guests get the uh, distinct honor of getting to do the shoot. shoot, the shoot yeah, I'm trying to teach you guys. You know, we you got know? a target. Ro move the drop box. We'll show no, you. No, we're not that good. We got a target. Oh. Look, try to hit that. Go ahead, try to hit that. Yeah. Oh. Did you see that one shot? I got that. That was nice. You've got I, the length. You, you, you should, they should have an Olympic sport. It should be Kush shooting. Kush shooting. Yeah, I think yeah, I'd take the gold, don't you think? Uh, I definitely oh, yeah. think you take yeah, the gold. Yeah, we'll have a little lesson for you after the show. Yeah. Now, guys, tell me about this. You were saying that this is the independent recordings? This is a re-release of the independent recordings, what we did before three, before Middle of Nowhere, actually. Really? Yeah. So, the because you look we... younger on the cover. Especially yeah, we do. You. you look a lot younger a lot with younger. your short yeah. hair. Um, yeah. that, this was what got us signed, actually. This is, this, it actually has the original versions of Mbop. And two other songs, Thinking of You and With You in Your Dreams, that are on Middle, middle of Nowhere. So you'll wow. hear the evolution of those songs. Yeah. Got you. Now, you guys write and produce all the songs? Yeah. yeah. On this uh, and on, on this the other one, too? On this one, we, we've worked with different producers, like on Middle of Nowhere and on the um, Christmas record, we worked with producers. But that was just us in a garage. Yeah, doing, yeah we did that about uh, two years ago. And we spent about four hours a song. I mean, it's, you have to remember, it's very much an independent record. The real reason that we released it was because we got so many requests from 
guys like these guys that, yeah, uh, people have- uh, just asking us about the record and then when they could get it and all that stuff. And because we got so many requests, we decided that we should let them have it. And so that's what it is. is. Now, how old were you when you first started writing songs? Uh, first started writing songs, he was nine. I was like nine I think he was or something. Nine. Like that in you? third grade. So um, yeah. I was about seven. And you, Zach? Do you write a lot of songs? I was about seven. Yeah. Do yeah, you write songs too? Oh, yeah. Oh, I you do? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, very we much so, songs. yeah. Now, us, who yeah. decided who was going to play what instrument? Um, we I, did. We natural did. inclination? Yeah. You know, no, somebody just said, you do play that instrument. No, we just did it ourselves. We just kind of said, whatever. Like a garage band getting yeah. together. Cool. Zach kind of had the knack for the drums. He, he's really got the pocket going on. And I, you know, I, I played piano for quite a while, but I had always wanted He had a fantasy to... of, of being like Chuck Berry, you know, playing guitar. Being oh, yeah. 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 So. And you had a fantasy of being who? I don't know. I think I was just stuck with the piano. Do you know what? Yeah, actually, gotta, you I was gotta, stuck with the piano. I, we I got a fantasy of being you guys. Uh, <laughs> wouldn't be bad. People screaming at you everywhere you go, huh? Well, it's it's very cool. It is very cool. We actually have a, a huge fan club at the hotel that's always there. Yeah. And I'd like to say hi to Green Jello. And it, it, Green Jello is out there. That's their name that they like to be called. Green Jello is the Green name Jell-O. of your groupies? They're the name of the groupies that are always hanging out at the hotel. Uh, I don't know. So you don't know? They asked us to say hi, so we're saying hi to Green All Green right, Jell-O. and here's your fan magazine called Mo. This, this is, is the fan club magazine, and everybody gets a <laughs> Everybody gets a copy of that. Now, how did this come about? You guys decided this, to do this. Well, the thing is, we're getting we get all these letters, and we can't really. It's so hard to respond to everyone. Right. We really wish we could. Yeah. So this is kind of like we're sending. It's like a really big newsletter. You know, it's right. thirty-two pages. So there's like all kinds of different articles and things. You and where can people get them? It's um, only it's, it's only through the actually. it's it's only the fan club. So you can go to the website hansonline.com. You can check it out there, or yeah, that's, join that's, the fan club. If you and you can join the fan club, and then you'll get that. You get four issues of that. Over the of How old are you so. now, dude? Uh, twelve. Twelve. Are you a little bored with the drums? Oh uh, no. I love watching you play because you know what? It looks like you're thinking of other things. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching you like, and then all of a sudden you realize you have your line. You're like, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> are you thinking of other things? You think? I think I think it's actually because he has such a large brain that he's uh, <laughs> not a you know he can think about all kinds of actually, other things. Actually, he's going he to now drumming on his head. You know, yesterday we were playing, and he's like, "Wouldn't it be really funny if you were playing and you hit your head and you like knock yourself out?" And then he goes and he knocks himself right in the head. <laughs> Do you guys know That's Rob Estes from Melrose Place? Yes, I wouldn't need a rock, but I just want to rock. Nice to meet you. You guys are great. Nice to meet you. You know, he's just hey, got a niece who is in desperate to... need. Yeah, we were watching. We, we, we need to trade an autograph for Austin. Heather yes. Locklear's. Done. A trade. Heather Heather trade. I'll stand right to you. <laughs> there you go. Now, would you, you mind if Alyssa came up and got to hug you? Because our whole wall is. Oh, we can take Alyssa, a picture. Come on. Yeah, you want Alyssa? Come on up here. She has a present for you. I'm oh, gonna watch that. Not- Alyssa, meet Hanson. Hanson, meet Alyssa. Awesome. All right, now get over there, Alyssa. Turn around with your brother. That is a lot of jelly beans right there. (laughs) Now look at me, Alyssa. Hanson, everyone say hi. All right, Alyssa, there you go. We're going to come back with Hanson and hear you on my song right after this. We'll be right back. It's uh, you should go get it and see how this great band began. Right now, singing one of their biggest hits, Hanson. Whoa. 
Hanson, ladies and gentlemen! And the Hanson fans! Don't hurt them, but come over. Don't hurt them. Say hello. Don't hurt them. Okay, we'll be right back after this break. Don't go away. When you have heartburn, 